So people keep asking us about the beehives and we've only been doing it for a few years. So I thought I'd do a quick one just to kind of explain how the hive works. And then we will look into a hive at a later date and we'll run a video and show you uh, what's happening inside. So just at the minute, because it's a warm day, the bees are doing what they're calling bearding. So what they're doing at the minute is a lot of them will be hanging out outside of the hive just to keep the hive cool. So less bodies in the hive keeps the hive a little cooler. So they're just regulating the temperature at the minute. So as you can see with this box, there's two blue boxes and then an orange box above. And if you can just see right in the middle of the boxes there, there's a metal strip. So what happens in the bottom two boxes is that's where the queen lives. So the queen lives in there and there's all frames in the boxes, which again we'll show you on a later video. And there's all honeycomb in there. What the queen does is they fill the honeycomb with um, honey and the queen will lay eggs in there. And this is where all the brood, this is where all the new bees are made. So these are called brood boxes. So as you can see next door, there's a white and a blue and a blue brood box and then the orange and the white box above. Again, there's the metal thing in between. So the metal thing in between is called a queen screen. And again, we'll show you a picture of that on a later video. And what that does, it's a screen that allows the worker bees through. So the worker bees are smaller than the queen. So the queen doesn't is not allowed in that orange box at the top. Yes, I can hear people saying, well, she can come out of the bottom and they'll go into the top there, but she doesn't come out of the hive unless she's, they're swarming or she's on a mating flight. So she'll live in the hive and she can't get through that screen. So the queen cannot get to the orange box. If the queen can't get to the orange box, all the workers in there make all the honeycomb and then they fill that full of honey and it never gets an egg laid in it, but it's ready for to have an egg laid in it. And what happens in harvest time is we take those frames away and that's where we get the honey from. So the bottom boxes is where all the work's done and all the new bees are made. And then the top box is where the honey is. So as you can see with the hives here, there's one top box on this one. There's two top boxes on that one. And then farther down, we have three top boxes on that one. So the more top boxes, the more honey being made. 